Hey everyone, so I get this question quite a bit when you meet with families. Why are obituaries so expensive to place in the newspaper? So I wanted to just give a little perspective as to why things do cost a lot when it comes to that. So the first thing to know is the funeral home is going to charge you exactly what the newspaper charges them. So it's a cash advance item. They're passing along that charge to the family. If it has an asterisk on it on the contract, that means the funeral home is charging you more. You cannot charge more for cash advance items unless there's an asterisk next to it on the contract. Side note to look at. So people will often say, well, who gets the paper anymore? Well, obviously enough that they have distribution. Most people will wait till the Sunday edition of a paper because if people do get the paper, um, and they choose to only get certain days, they're going to get that Sunday paper because it's the bulkier usually has the most obituaries, especially if people aren't doing services, but they want to place a notice, they'll wait till Sunday. So people do get the newspaper. It is a good way to spread news. But just like listing your car for sale, it is a classified item. So when you list an obituary, same thing. You're paying for square inch of ad space. So when you list a your car, you know, 1992 Camaro for however much money, and it's a two-line thing, and you pay $85 for that, just look at how much an obituary is compared. Going into a larger city newspaper is going to be way more money. Small local papers may not charge, or it may only be a flat fee for no matter how long it is. So every newspaper is going to charge a little different, but you're paying for square ad space in that paper.